Jordan Peterson has called for the West to embark on regime change in Iran because uh, uh, misogyny or something. If any of you have been particularly taken by this story today, you know, you could always put pen to paper and write your congressman or your senator or, and let them know that you're not all that happy about the situation in Iran and that if uh, the politicians got their act together and were stalwart in their opposition to this fundamentalist, totalitarian, mis misogynistic, brutal regime, that maybe it could be pushed over and that would be a nice object lesson to totalitarian tyrants everywhere in the world. Marvelous idea. Just have the US military industrial complex overthrow a foreign government by force to spread Western liberal values around the Middle East. A remarkably novel idea that's never been tried before and is sure to be a resounding success. These are f shots being fired now in Baghdad. Michael Tracy called him out on it. Jordan Peterson calls on the West to get their act together and overthrow the Iranian government in the name of opposing misogyny. Apparently, Jordan Peterson is one of those guys who should just stay embroiled in pronoun controversies. And Peterson hit back with this. I read this a couple of times and failed to understand your point. Is this pro-Iranian theocracy comment, or is it somehow about what I hypothetically think about women? Care to clarify? Basically saying if you disagree with regime change in Iran, you support the totalitarian Iranian government, well, you hate women. Yeah, bit of a shitty comeback, Jordan, that, isn't it? The kind of straw man argument you routinely complain about when it's done to you. So what you're saying is you're pro-Iranian theocracy. Tracy hit back with this. Sure, happy to clarify. You're calling for US intervention to topple a foreign government, also known as regime change, which is probably the most reliably insane thing the US government ever does. And you frame it as some sort of great moral crusade to impose gender equality. Oof. Mike Cernovich also went in hard, accusing Peterson of being a pirate. Piper. Showing his true agenda and leftism, Jordan uses, you must hate women and love terrorism when asked why you'd be agitating for Americans, which Jordan is not, to support regime change in Iran. Critics noted that Peterson's been getting very cosy with the Israeli government since he was hired by Ben Shapiro's Daily Wire. Now, I'm fully aware of not falling into that obnoxious trap of demanding everyone, quote, on our side has all the same opinions. But Peterson's had some well-dodgy takes of late. His emotionally incontinent inability to avoid getting irrationally angry over mean comments on his YouTube videos has led him to call repeatedly for an end to internet anonymity. Because anybody can post anything about anyone, no matter how denigrating and derisive, especially if they do it anonymously, and there's zero consequence. In fact, quite the opposite. If they're good at it, they get a lot of attention, and the social media companies will monetize it. And so not only is it not inhibited, it's actually facilitated. An agenda elitist technocrats are also pushing under the umbrella of digital ID and central bank digital currencies. And come on, Peterson must know why people want to maintain their anonymity, to remain employed, to protect their family, to not be targeted by the same psycho, very online mobs that Peterson supposedly opposes. He was also very squishy on masks and the old jib jab early on when he said this. You know, I'm wearing the masks when I'm required to. Get the damn vaccine and get. let's get the hell over this. So that's three pretty big issues, isn't it? Digital ID, neoliberal interventionist invasion, and the old jibby jab, where in every case, he's come down on the wrong side. So you can't expect me to give him a free pass just because he's Jordan Peterson. He needs to be called out. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Get early access to videos, exclusive live streams, and personally DM me. You've seen how much I get demonetized all the time. Well, this is how you support me. By subscribing at pauljosephwatson.locals.com. Please click the link in the description.